Hi, now I'm going to show you how to combine the video and audio together by using iMovie. So first of all, I click, I open iMovie. Create new movie. At this time, first of all, I have to drag the video file followed by the audio file. Must be video file followed by the audio file. Because the the length of the audio file may depend on the video. Okay, now the next step, I'm going to press, I'm going to select the video file first, followed by Command plus T. Select the video file, click, and then hit Command plus T. So if you don't add the command plus T, so that's the difference. If I add the background, right, it will go, it will not go to the second screen very smoothly. So I'll add this effect to make sure is uh, to to make the effect better. Okay. By selecting the the mark there, you can you can adjust the view. So that when you trim the video, it will make the trim easier. Okay, now I'm start trimming. So first of all, I have to find where I start when I start playing for the video first or audio first. Either way is okay. I also I can adjust the lens of the background. I also can adjust the lens of the transaction also, but but uh the I also can adjust the video. So it's very flexible. Okay, now I have to adjust a bit for the if I, I can so the so the background normally I'll set longer in order to make sure my topic is clear. I mean to make sure it's not rush. Okay, now the video and audio trimmed together. For the trimming, it's quite tricky because you need to spend some time to practice. Okay, after all, you add the background at the back. Also, if there is no transaction, you can add a transaction by hitting Command plus D. At this time, you can add the title. There are many many titles. You can just drag the thing you like and put on the top of the... Well, put where you want to put the title. For this scenario, we are put just at the back. One is the title. The other one is the thank you message. Okay, you can click here to adjust the front size. Here's the final outcome. Okay, next, once you click, once you finished, click and save. Just click the top right, uh, uh, just click the button at the top right corner and export.